we're live. Nice. Well, this is where we pretty much left off. Yeah, the zombie attack. I don't think. Yeah, yeah. I don't think you should use a full blaze on that. Oh, maybe I should have used a full blaze. Thanks, Joe. Right, um. <laughs> oh, you can have someone useless to finish it off, like uh, Arthur. Let me get out of that. Well, actually, if I'm in here, only one can get at me at a time. It's actually, I'm gonna be stuck. Never mind. Um. Uh. I'm sure I've missed. Me seeing you playing this. Yeah. I really get like that urge to play a strategy, like an old strategy game like this. That's that's half the fun, man. Is yeah. Well, yeah, Gong will be my meat shield. Yeah, that always goes well. Gong's the man. He's the man with the plan. Yeah, Ken really doesn't do that much damage, but well, at least he's a tank. Yeah, he's, that's, that's all you really need from him. He's a million hit points. Yeah, the fact that that one thing didn't move scares me. Uh, by the way, happy St. Patrick's Day, Joe. Oh yeah, that's a thing. Oh god, Gong is almost dead. But he's tanking it, like a champ. These yeah. zombies are no joke, actually. Yeah, what damage? They hit. Yeah. Bye, Gort. Oh, man. Oh, remember Gort is fucking made of iron. <laughs> All that alcoholism really made him tough. You only take as much damage as you care about people, <laughs> and Gort doesn't give out anybody. Okay, so you should probably like either uh, like move Gonk or move low to heal Gorg. Yeah, or you can heal Gong and then use Gong to heal Gord. Yeah, <laughs> let's go with that plan. Anyways, yeah, for St. Patrick's Day, I have an uh, Irish cream soda here. It uh, it tastes like a chocolate uh, egg cream. Huh. Well, uh, I for uh, for St. Patrick's Day. Uh, and, uh... Yeah, no, it's nothing. Nothing? I'm so sorry, Joe. We, no, we don't, it's just we don't celebrate St. Patrick's Day. It's not something we celebrate. I mean, not that I care for what your religion is or anything, but, like, you, I thought you did have, um... What's the word? Uh, hold on, wait, I can do this. I thought you did have, um, uh, Catholicism over there. Oh, no, we do. Many of my family are Catholic. Right. So you think St. Patrick's Day would be a day they'd celebrate, right? They don't. What the hell am I doing? Or if they do, it's more of the more, uh, <laughs> devout, I guess. It's, we don't celebrate St. Patrick's Day like you guys do. I mean, all we, all I had was, like, I mean, corned beef and had an Irish soda. Yeah, like, we don't associate, like, we don't associate with Irish and, like, drinking and some of the sort. Well, yeah, there are people that, like, consider this a day to get crunk. But, uh, I mean, with the quarantine and everything, I don't think that many people are out getting drunk. Only the most drunk are out there, David. No, low. Goodbye, low. When you're... Oh. Well, at least he survived. Yeah. At least. Yeah. Arthur is dead in one hit. Yes. <laughs> you scared him. <laughs> Hello, 
get out, no, get out of there, look. Look at how good I am. Ta-da. Oh, what the fuck? Why is Gort so tough? Compared to Luke, Gort is like a machine. Like, that was a crit, and Gort was like, what was that? A baby slap? <laughs> let, let, actually, let me... Just because of these rankings that we've been, like, seeing, let me see where Gort stands. <laughs> you're you're reevaluating the list. I look at it because it's funny. The fact that I could find a tier list is what mostly amazes me. Where is it? Actually, this is skeleton is dead in one hit. Isn't it? There it is. This skeleton. Uh. It says here that this is a good unit that's subject to RNG. Subject to RNG? Check out this. I don't know. My boy's I mean, just cleaving through the skeletons. Yeah. Really need to get that uh, armadillo man. I don't know when we get them. I don't know how to but get it. Looks cool. <laughs> uh, eventually, uh, he'll be like around what is like a sheep farm, if I remember correctly. <laughs> <laughs> Wonder how many people are gonna be watching this like, oh they're just cheating, cool. Cheating! Cheating! Who cares? Who cares? The the great artists of the game, the classical masters. The dead ones? It's it came out in 92, Joe, don't act like it came out in like 62. Okay, the old ones? Like, the crap it? Oh. The ones that probably would die to Corona? Oh, uh, well, now we're demonetized. Good job, Joe. <laughs> <laughs> That's really need to bleep me on YouTube. Don't like forget I, to edit. Like I care, we're, we're never demonetized. <laughs> yes, we were so getting monetized yeah. either way, right? <laughs> Highlight the video from this part, and then skip over your part, and then highlight the rest. You, you forever... <laughs> David, if you ever monetize your channel, for every video I made you lose monetization, I'll give you five dollars. Wow, that's more than I, what I would have made. Um... Oh, wait a minute. Let's say a maximum of 50, because I don't trust myself. A maximum of 50. Fair enough, yeah. Oh. How did a zombie quickly evade? Hold on. <laughs> you don't understand, David. Like, part of his body just fell before you hit it. That's how he evaded. You're perpetually always killing someone. They're they're just too fast. <laughs> too quick, too fast. These corpses just they're <laughs> they're faster than the boss last time. Magic is the the real winner here. Isn't it always? Hey, I'm level 6 now. My attack went up. Yeah, go along. He's making his way. Oh, Gog actually got a decent level up. That's great. It's because he's holding the Domingo egg, I'm sure. Sure. Yeah. I'd say that. So, what's, I wonder what that, like, purple zombie is. 
I haven't checked because it just hasn't been doing anything. It's a dead zombie. Ghoul. 23 it's attack. It's a ghoul. It's 23 attack compared to this mortar machine. Alright, so it's like a little bit stronger. Oh, uh, I mean, a little bit will still kill some of you people. Oh, wait. Hans, no. Yeah! I think that's the first time I've seen one of my people dodge. Hans is just too thin, David. Alright, now I'm afraid of Arthur. Dude, goodbye, Arthur. <laughs> Arthur's level 5, man. Whoa! My boy! Arthur's level 5, David. Yeah. He's so useless. Apparently he's gonna be learning magic, so I'll hold out on that. <laughs> I mean, that's the thing, at least he's a unit. Like, I think that's the most, the, the best thing he's got going for him, David. He's a unit. He can be used for distractions. Disappear! <laughs> Perish. Oh, new that's... sleep spell. Ooh. Debuff. Nice. I don't think May should be. Uh, oh. Yeah, some of my physical units appear quite useless against the undead. Yes, some. Good thing you're you have two mages. And Gord. <laughs> yeah, and Gord. Gord doesn't care. Gord, no, oh, Gord is our, th yeah, no, David, Gord is our third wizard. He's our kill everything wizard. Yeah. Well, I'm also thinking like maybe it's just the weapon some of these guys have, because like the steel arrow seems to really up Tons's potential use. Yeah. Should have sell a soul of all let's, those uh, swords. Let's, that let's not have damage. Arthur in the front line. Yeah. You should have sold all those swords that dealt more damage. They did not. They did. I told you. Just shaking my head at you, Joe. You did not. <laughs> but I literally went to the items, like, went to see the item descriptions and saw it did more damage than some of the swords you have, and I'm like, yeah, they did. Just don't have them anymore. <laughs> 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 it's so petty. So, yeah, we. Oh, go yeah. on. Oh, go on. No, I was just saying, yeah, we have to level up Chris. I'm, like, super sure and sleep won't affect this. You could try, you don't know. Just deal 13 damage. But this is a risk I'm willing to take. Nice. Court, you slow son of a bitch. Just like David. That's fine. Because it's all on Gong now. Come on, six damage. Ah. <laughs> all right. Goodbye. Oh, what the heck?
Yep, never mind. quiet anger. <laughs> like I'm about to play the game without ever using a unit. It's treating it like a 17 fights of protect the civilian. Hmm. Like Luke. way to get them all. state of anger for having died. Well, I can at least use detox now.
Magic saves the day. <laughs> Those deadly attacks, though. I should stick around for Lo to heal me. By me. Oh. Alright, fine. <laughs> you like that. Tag me twice in a row. Damage. <laughs> really 
want to, but I just can't. Terribly interesting <laughs> fight, isn't it? Fortunately, it's over. Or at least it better be. Yeah, all right. Late. I am Balboroy. I was turned to stone by Dark Soul when he took the bodies of the dead. Balboroy, oh, that was fast to join us right there. Alright, thanks, Balboroy. I will join you to fight Dark Soul's evil. Just shove me out of the way. What's this? Just a holy symbol? Nothing I can my... And, like, the town is all gone because they were really the monsters. Yeah. Okay. Oh, hi, I'm. Thank you for saving Balbori. Let me go with you so I too can fight evil. I have bird boys now. To reach Uri or you run Batol, you must go through Bruce Stoke. Jeez. We will guide you there. I will join your friends. Looks in the Shining Force head towards Boo Stoke. What awaits them there? The legacy of the Ancients is still a mystery. Will they ever solve it? And there is chapter two. Yeah, I want to record the exploits of how I got whipped in one move. The Shining Force arrives in Boostoke, a town built into a mountainside. Oh, this is where my werewolf boy comes from. We're a falling rocks. I miss my daddy. When's he coming back? Oh. <laughs> Nothing is unusual. But, oh, no, I, I searched that lady instead of talking to her? My father was taken away to the quarry, too. Please bring him back. Oh, all the, all the men were stolen by Rufost. Please rescue my husband from the quarry, our only hope. What? That's fine. Um... Those are solid, huh? Zylo is crazy. Hey, crazy boy. Oh, wait, that's the priest. Sure, it's anything new. Please don't go this way. They'll punish me for letting you through. Alrighty. Oh, this is the headquarters. How's the army looking? Oh, someone is dead. It's right, Arthur. Forgotten. Let's go, Rezim. <laughs> Oh, 
Let's just see him. Arthur is in bad shape. Yeah, I'd say. I can revive Arthur. Yeah, please do. The army poured something into Zylo's drink and made him crazy. We had to lock him up to protect ourselves. Is this in here? Never mind. The next boost token? How? The Runefrost army is gathering there, doubtless preparing an attack. I see you. Okay, then. Just leave him alone, then. Xylo's cage. Xylo's inside, but he's been driven mad. Only the Lunar Dude can save him. Okay, he's just locked up in there. Oh, there we go. Talk to my mother first. I have been waiting for Warriors of the Shining Force. Yes, I am. Great, you must help us. The Runefrost army took our men to dig in the quarry. They're looking for a weapon of the ancients. A laser eye, Diane, can lead you there. If Zylo were sane, he could surely help you. Hey, if you're going to the quarry to rescue men, you can count me in. Yeah, got another elf. It's not Ben, that's the lady that I had to talk to. So there's more over here. What a small house. Oh, but it's only half done. Yeah. Hey, you're a man. I'm a master alchemist. I can make anything. Can I help you? Yeah. First, you must help me. To cure Zylo, I need to make a lunar dude, but to do that, I need moonstone. Let's go to the quarry, find moonstone, and bring it back to me. Alright, we'll do. Oh. Master, we have found it. The laser eye, at last. This is the end of that cursed shining force. Get rid of those men from Boost Oak. They are of no further use to us. Alert, intruders. What, the shining force? Stop them. We must have time to remove the laser eye. Alright. So, Master Mage, and, as always, Tao. So, yeah, without Joe, let's just stop it here for now.